Good morning, friends. We're going fishing. <laughs> Travis is in the back. We're heading to the lake. Um, we're not going far, but we've been begging my dad to take us fishing for weeks now, and today it's finally happening. Do you have anything to say? Uh, no. <laughs> we, hope, we hope to catch a fish or two. But. How many fish do you think we're going to catch, Trav? I think at least one. I think on every fishing trip we've gone on, we've caught one fish. So <laughs> I'm, I'm going to bet one or more. Who's going to catch the fish? Um, I think your dad caught it last time, which was like five years ago. And you caught one over at my dad's house. Mm -hmm. So I think it might be my turn. He says we're taking turns. <laughs> this is what an expert level fisher person looks like, in case anyone was wondering. So this is a lake that's literally like five minutes or less from our house. We could probably have walked down here if we wanted to. Danger, no diving, shallow water, no swimming. Deal. No swimming. It is very peaceful out this morning. The lake is very still. Travis pulled out the water shoes for this excursion. I don't use them for anything else. True. My hat and my worms and my coffee. Check, check, and check. These two spots look really good have some big old bass sitting under the little cats. There was a fish that jumped right there. Really? Yeah. Ooh, see, this will be the test. Oh, it put the motor back down. You can push that back in when it starts up. I have a job. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Houston, we have a problem. Sound very promising. <laughs> <laughs> this might be a very short boat ride. Seems good. Travis throwing down the anchor. Who's baiting my hook for me? I don't want to choose which worm I sentenced to death. You can choose for me. Well, so far I've cast two times and broken one fishing line on a lily pad. I got snagged. So Travis is paddling us over to get this bother. Nice. <laughs> It is 72 and overcast today. That is our fishing weather. We can Google it. What was that, Kara? I got a fish, but it got away. <laughs> Lost it. Almost got a fish. fish story over here. Yeah, the big ones always get you away. You saw it, right? Yeah. I didn't see nothing. I saw it too. <laughs> I lost mine. I had a bobber under over here trying to get the camera ready. <laughs> you having fun yet? Yeah, I think I we're having fun. I'm having fun. <laughs> That's a bluegill. 
I got Kara, a bluegill. First fish of the day. Woo, woo. Mm, 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 mm. Not half bad. And Travis is chasing after his monster over here. Well, it was in there, but... Oh. He drifted a bit. We've had several large fish get away now, but, but we're pretty sure they were big ones. Yeah. Show everyone your fish! It's huge. Proud Papa, this <laughs> big old bass. What kind of fish is that? It's a perch. I think it's a perch. It's a perch! Can keep that one, we can use it for bait. Just toss it out this side. Toss it back out. <laughs> See what you get to it. Two fish. Oh, big old bass. Woohoo! Look at you. That's, that's bass. I think that's legal. I'm not sure. Here, I'll Google. You want to that? Yeah. I hate to lose my spinner. It's caught half the fish. 50% <laughs> of the fish caught on that spinner. I uh, hooked up on something pretty good. Don't worry, I'm an expert caster. That's good. Well, we're thinking of giving up. We might be done for the day. It's about time to get home so I can feed Rena again. We caught two fishes. Well, two fish that we're taking home with us. One bluegill and then dad caught up that bass. And that was it. Caught a little baby perch, two or three little baby perches that all went back in the water. Some we guys. had a nice boat ride. Yeah, which is all we were doing out here anyway, having a boat ride. This looks fun. Got a jet ski with a tube behind it. That looks really fun. Wouldn't mind trying that. Well, we made it back. Didn't even have to row. So story time, we're cruising along in the middle of the lake, just minding our business. And I look back here and there is a mouse <laughs> on this ledge. It kind of scurries over here, scurries back, tries to go that way, goes back. And then I kid you not, the mouse jumps ship. It jumps off the boat into the lake. Yeah, it was in the middle of the lake too. It was not nearby the <laughs> shore. So that mouse is dead. Um, unless it's a really, really good swimmer. So that's something I've never seen before. And apparently it was just on the boat with us that whole time. Um, Cause that was like on the way back, but that happened. So anyway, we killed more than just fish today. Travis is doing some last minute attempts to catch a fish in the shallows here. Atlas is very interested in our fish catch. Yeah, those are not for you, Atlas. That's pretty good, Atlas. <laughs> <laughs> this is my catch. This is our dinner. Hi, BB. Did you miss us? Yes, you did. We caught so many fish. We're gonna eat them for dinner. There's two fish. Yay! Did you have so much fun with grandma? So, I'm a little rusty in my filleting, um, but not too bad. Just salt and pepper there. And then I got some butter crisp crackers that we're gonna bread those with. And we're gonna throw them in a pan. 
And they're in. Reminds me of my younger days when we used to do this all the time. Yum! Peep that sizzle. Garden fresh zucchini. Well, how is it? I don't know. I'm super nostalgic. This reminds me of every weekend at my dad's in the summer when we go fishing and cook some of these up. It's like less fishy than tilapia and tender. It's great. It's great. Mm -hmm. So the bass is really good. Are you going to try my bluegill? Bluegill and perch are like my favorite. The fish that I caught amounted to about two bites of fish. So I provided dinner tonight. I am the provider. Did you have something to add? I lost my spoon. She did lose her spoon, it's true.